All right, so we just got the uh, alignment done here. So I'm gonna go through with the car, kind of give you my impressions of the GT500 lower control arms and ball joints, see if it actually does make a difference or not. Um, but so far, um, just normal driving, it feels a lot better, a lot more solid. Um, it's really, before it used to have a clunk when you'd go over bumps, that seems to be gone. I haven't heard that yet, but we'll go out and uh, hit some more, uh, you know, see if we can get some winding roads or something and kind of test the handling out because it's supposed to be quite a bit better with these uh, control arms on it. So we'll give it a try. All right, here we go. found much other than a uh, roundabout to try them out in but it's uh, a lot more solid than it was before everything you could feel kind of had a lot more sway in it before oh, we'll try this one out here So yeah, I'd say it was worth it. I think they're uh, pretty dang good. This lady probably thinks I'm crazy wearing a GoPro on my head. say overall it made it feel a whole lot more stable um, even just normal driving um, it feels you know not as much like an old car even though it is it's pretty old but it uh, has a lot more it's a lot more uh, I would say a little stiff so you feel a little bit more but that is a combination of uh, my car being lowered and these new uh, lower control arms with the stiffer bushings and ball joints and everything, but hard to uh, say what it would be compared like to a new stock set of ball joints or control arms, because uh, mine were pretty worn out. But the, also the uh, outer tie rod ends were about to come apart. Boots were ripped off, they were super loose, so that helped tighten things up in the front end. But, uh, definitely after the alignment now my wheel is straight which hasn't happened for a long time before it used to be a little bit to the left to get it to go straight and uh, we even counted the turns that it took to get the uh, outer tie rods off and tried to get them back as close as we could but uh, put all together with all the new stuff the steering wheel was turned like clear over like this to make it go straight so Got to have it aligned right after, but luckily we didn't have to go too far. So that's all for this video. Make sure to uh, subscribe and look for the next uh, cool video coming out.